Hello, beautiful souls. Be that as it may, the way I approached it was like the behavior that most people find acceptable. I just wish you could pardon me for being such a nitwit and not feel that it was because I despised you or was attempting to be some malevolent, negative force in your life. I deserve nothing, but I feel like you're the one individual who could comprehend. You are the one individual who gets me, and the one individual who can fulfill all that I want. It seems you are filled with guilt towards yourself for listening to others in the past regarding your dreams and for taking their bad advice, which led you down a temporary and wrong path. You're blaming others and yourself for your current situation, especially concerning your change of location, destiny, or unfulfilled travel plans. Currently, there's an ongoing battle within you, and you're feeling exhausted. You've reached a point of exhaustion that's making you consider giving up on your travel plans. You're entangled in your mind, still dealing with those people or rather, you're tired of fighting too. In your current blogs, you are unable to confront things in a healthy way, which is essential for breaking free from difficult emotional patterns. These patterns keep arising, and your needs remain unrecognized and unmet. Unfortunately, you're falling back into old patterns of ignoring your trauma rather than exploring it. You need to halt this regression, step out of the past, and adopt a faster viewpoint. Tap into the unused potential within your mind, learn new skills, and break the cycle of stagnant energy. Give your best wherever you are right now. You may be blaming others for your situation, but in reality, it's driven by your fears, nervousness, and an all-talk-no-action attitude. Confusion, anxiety, linear thinking, and wasteful gossip are the true reasons behind your current state. Exercise caution when receiving information at this time, as it might lead to misconceptions. Avoid becoming a part of any gossip. This is a time for introspection instead of wasting time on such activities. Your travel plans will eventually come to fruition in the future. In your association with your partner, things are moving and advancing. However, what's currently happening is that individuals are deliberately coming forward to create issues, obstacles, and hindrances. At this ongoing moment, the universe is serving these individuals with their karma. For many of you, in different cases and circumstances, your partner has made a decision to move towards you, call you, text you, or generally bring equity into the relationship. However, there are individuals who are dissatisfied with that. They don't believe in fairness and think you don't deserve it. There's a compelling reason to set things right with you. These individuals could be anyone associated with your partner not necessarily a toxic ex or friend. They might have karmic connections with you and your partner, which is driving their actions. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.